up glam squad i'm back again with another video i am stephanie nicole if you're new and today i'm bringing to you guys my beauty room tour slash makeup collection my makeup collection is not very large i don't buy a lot of makeup but i have quite a bit of makeup in my opinion so this is going to be just showing you guys my makeup collection slash my beauty room um and yeah, before we get into this video, please like and subscribe, tell a friend, tell a friend your girl just posted a new video. And yeah, we're going to get right into the video. Bye guys. So, this is walking into my beauty room. This is an overview of my beauty room. I know it's not much, but it's just enough space for me right now. This is an overview. And I have my ring light on just to give me more lighting. I need to cut the other one on too. This one be giving me the blues. So anyway, that ring light over there will not cut on, but I'm going to come in and start over here. So right here is just a stand that I got, I think from Walmart or a place like that. That just has a couple of things that I like to keep up here, like on top, um, flowers. Right here I have um, three palettes. The Tartlet Pro Glow palette. I haven't used it yet, but um, it is a blush and highlight palette. Some can use it as a bronzer with the two colors down there but I can't because my melanin is popping you know <laughs> I have a Morphe palette I haven't used this palette either yet so I just keep it um, right here no I have used this palette or I might have swatched it or whatever I probably use this shade right here but um I don't use it often so I just keep it here on display and this is a highlighter palette it has a lot of shades um, that can be catered to different skin tones and back here is a Smashbox palette it looks like this and I haven't used this one at all um, I don't pretty much know what to say about this palette like I can't I don't really like um, any of the shades in here I may have swatched a couple of them um, this is probably about the only shade that I would use if I ever use this palette um, but not a fan of this palette but it was gifted to me so I just keep it on display I like the packaging it's pretty cool and also right here I just keep a Sephora bag just because I keep some brushes right here which I don't use or never have used um, so I just keep them on display because they're pretty and um, I have some cotton balls with some um, q-tips in there it was filled up really pretty like q-tips on each side with cotton balls in the middle but I've used it a lot so um, down here um, just some a brush holder with some beads in it um, a flower holder um, and some benefit products right there down here is just a piggy bank for Kari so coming up here on the wall I just keep some um, little cute little sayings better late than ugly and also blending is my cardio with some lips and lashes and right here is my DIY little bench so I made this bench DIY. I got um, a little some boards under here and I put um, a blanket on top with some pillows and down here are some crates. I found out how to do this on YouTube and if you would like to learn yourself, I will try to tag the girl's name um, down below in the description box. But this is what I keep down here on mine um, I have a couple of candles I have a little cute little decor piece little doggy um, right here I have a picture frame that says good vibes only that's what I'm all about good vibes honey okay I have a little mushroom right there 
right here I have a flower pot full of flowers I love flowers and I love white and pink flowers at that and I have another decor piece it's like a little dove and um, if you want to know where I got these products from um, I got the little decor pieces like well the candles the candle stands the little dog um, the picture frame the little everything down here I got from Dollar Tree except for um, the paper with the um, good vibes only on it um and i got these crates i think from um hobby lobby um the blanket from walmart the pillows from walmart and the um boards under here i got from um hobby lobby as well at the same time that i got the crates those picture frames up there also got from dollar tree i love dollar tree okay say some of them coins girl if you can so moving along to the section right here i have some picture frames that one is broken and that one is broken too but i wasn't gonna take them down okay because um they're already up there so it says on this one like a boss um she believes she could so she did um and this one says beauty begins the moment you decide to be yourself coco chanel and that is correct like you have to be yourself right here in the middle it says hello gorgeous hi you know hi everyone that comes into my room is gorgeous so i want them to feel gorgeous coming in and going out but right here i may feel out of, sound out of breath <laughs> because i've been moving all day then i decided to film this video in the midst of me doing a lot of moving so i'm kind of kind of tired but um these are some pictures some little polo word pictures of my beautiful family here is kari and jeremiah jeremiah if you don't know um he's my little brother he's just turned five like three days ago right here is my niece leah and kari and me and kari these were all taken on christmas and i love them so i decided to keep them right here where I can see them every day. And I just have some little sayings. Best buds, a happy life, and you know, so on and so forth. So, I'm gonna just stay over here in this area because this is where I am. Um, don't mind the freaking dirty old stained up dresser because it's so stained up. It's, it used to have so much makeup on top of it. And I painted it, but I know I have to paint it over. Like, makeup is everywhere in this beauty room. Like, all on the walls and stuff like that. But don't pay attention to that. Right here, I just keep some flowers, a candle, another little decor piece. Um, the letter S. I think I was gifted that S. I think my sister made that for me, like, years ago. And um, over here is just some makeup that I have on display that's in my background of my pictures. I mean, not my pictures, but my videos here on YouTube. Um, on display is where I keep um, a few Milani lipsticks, liquid lipsticks. Um, back here is where I keep some Morphe um, lipsticks, I mean lip glosses, and they're so pretty. Let me swatch them. Let me swatch one for you right Two that I swatched, and this one is called Bewitched, and this one doesn't have a name at the bottom like the other ones, but they're very pretty. And shiny, I never wear them like they just be up here collecting dust, honey. Because I don't even like using stuff like this, like they were just beautiful, so I just had to get them. So, up here, I keep some Anastasia Beverly Hills lipsticks, I don't use these either. Like everything that I keep up here. I don't use unless I'm just going in these little things um, to make sure I use them. Can you come off of here? Cool brown. It's a matte lipstick. And focus. I like it. I probably would never wear it, but it's cool, you know. Um, Fina Posh is supposed to be up there. But um, I keep some Makeup Revolution um, powders. This is These are setting powders. This is the Ghost <laughs> shade. This is the Banana um, 
that's the charger for one of my little lights and I just keep some lip pencils or whatever right here is where I keep some liquid lipsticks on display these are all different kinds um, I love the Maybelline ones they're they're everything but I just find myself finding myself never using these shades like ever in here is where I keep some primers so I have Maybelline um, Master Prime I have in here a few foundations and um, contour sticks, Anastasia Beverly Hills, uh, NYX, Sila, um, and Maybelline. Right here is where I keep some highlighters and like bronzers and stuff like that, and blushes as well. So right here I keep um, two CoverGirl blushes and highlighter. Right here I keep a um, I'm on um, powder and right here is where I keep a Fenty Beauty highlighter which is all broken up because it drops all the time like it be dropping but the packaging is so pretty so sleek and so beautiful like I love I love Fenty a little puzzle piece in there what you doing in there <laughs> but right here is where I keep a couple of palettes that I need to use so I keep a Valid Voss palette in here it's very pretty very pretty I haven't used no shade in here besides that one and it's an iridescent shade so I don't really like it because it's not white but um and I keep an Alomar palette in here and that's it for what's right here this is the area that I film at this is my background what you see in my videos and right here is what I keep on my stand so I just keep my everyday glam everything is so like dirty and nasty so don't judge me and here is some things that I just need to use and um these are some palettes some highlighters some um powders and these are the two ring lights that's in front of me this one I just got so yeah and over here I have a lamp that is marble right here I ordered this from Amazon. I have a little light box right here. I was uh, moving my stuff when we was getting carpet, so uh, my things fell out, but it said in here, which I need to put back, is Jesus is love. Down here is just where I keep um, some little, little holders for like my thumbtacks and like everything that I need. My phone holder down there with some notebooks and a um, book holder. Right here is where I keep a little dirty little stool. But moving on to this section over here. This is just an overview of how this little area looks. Let me get my ring light. If I can get some more lighting. So over here is where I keep my... Um, what are these things called? I forget what they're called, but y'all know what they're called. Um, some flowers, a little Eiffel Tower, a little piece. I got that from Amazon. Um, some card holder, a card holder. I don't um, give out business cards anymore. I don't know why, I just don't. But um, those are some old business cards. And they look like this. Don't worry, because I don't even have their number anymore. I'm going to change my number like three times after that. But this is my Instagram. So, you know, if you want to go follow my Instagram, it's right there. And if you want to email me about business or anything like that, um, I do still have this email. And yeah. Right here is my favorite station ever. It's just so cute. Like, so cute and so girly. I keep the thing going of pink, gold, and white. So, this is how it looks. Right here, I just keep a frame. It says, stay golden. Um, a little glass little um, bottle that I keep I said I was gonna put like every goal that I accomplished I was gonna put in here I've accomplished a few things this year and I just have yet to put them in there but now that I'm thinking about it I need to write those things down now and put them in here because at the end of the year I want to look in that thing and see all the things I've accomplished and um, write new goals down to accomplish for the following year so right here 
I keep some flowers, keep going with my thing because I love flowers. And over here is where I keep some um, champagne glasses. Um, I use these glasses celebrating someone's birthday. And um, I just keep them right here just because. Um, and here is where I keep like all of my wine glasses that I've used up. Like I've drunk way more wine than this, but I haven't put the bottles in there because I like totally forgot. Like the last time I put a bottle in here when I finished it, it was like <laughs> like a month or two ago. So I've forgotten, but I've drunk a lot more wine. Uh, don't judge me. Here is my little um ottoman and this is where um Kari is a lot of the time and this is where I keep a lot of my snacks and candy and stuff like that that Kari loves. I should never tell her where my stash spot was because she's always in it. Oh my god. Right here is a frame that my mom got me and this is from Marshalls and it says I tend to lash out. I love it. It's very special to me because my mom didn't have to get this for me, but she did. She thought about me and I love it. It will always be around. It will always be right here in my lash in my um beauty room. And it was perfect because it is black, white, and gold. And she didn't even know, like she didn't even think about the theme of my beauty room, but it was the right color. Right here is where I keep, um, this is my vanity. This is where, um, I don't even do my makeup right here no more. I do my client's makeup right here because I always sit right here in this area. But, um, this is the vanity mirror. I made this on my own. The lights are from Amazon. You can get them separately. And the mirror I found for 10 dollars okay ten dollars on facebook someone was selling it and i was like yes i'm going to pick that up asap actually this mirror right here i got um also on facebook it was like twenty dollars and it used to be a bathroom mirror and it's very huge and i love it moving back to this area this is where i keep all of my client brushes i have so many other brushes but um, they're in my closet because they've been dirty for months and I just don't want to use them anymore. So I'm probably going to just throw them away. These brushes are mostly all dirty except this uh, thing here and the one on the end. But the ones in the middle are dirty. I have to wash off. I just had a big wedding um, yesterday. So these brushes are kind of dirty. But moving on to what's in my vanity. So up here is where I keep all of my foundations and my concealers i've gotten rid of a lot of um foundations because um they just ran out but um i have a variety of foundations like they're all like stacked on top of each other like back there and stuff like that and i keep um a few powders up here i keep um a nyx foundation and i keep a Stila foundation where right here is where I keep some stick um, contour sticks. Right here is where I keep like all of my glitters, my um, liquid liners, my loose glitters, and loose pigments. So I have some pigments back there that I got from this brand like a couple, uh, probably like three years ago, and I still keep them because I haven't ran out of them, and um, they're still pretty loved. Right here is where I keep like a lot of my glitter liners and my regular um, liquid liners. Um, some of these I got from Amazon. Um, some of them I got from Ulta. Some of them are NYX. Um, some of them are Ulta Beauty. And yeah. But most of them I got from Amazon because I like to get my stuff in bulk. And Amazon has really good prices right here. I keep the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow, which I never use. Like it's like brand new. I never really use it. Um, over here I keep some um loose glitter. I got these from Amazon as well, along with these. I got some NYX ones, I have some Ulta ones, I have some um little pomades for your eyes like not pomades but the um what are these called just 
to um, put on before your eyeshadow. And right here I have some bigger loose glitters and I think I will never run out of this freaking glitter as long as I'm doing makeup like because it's so much in these things like oh my god like the reason this one is gone and a couple others is because they were wasted all on the floor so yeah that is what's in this one and I love this drawer I just love like just looking at it it's just so beautiful Right here is where I keep all of my um, my bronzers, blush, highlighters, and my powders. So I have some palettes back here which I don't um, use anymore, but I still like to keep them back there just because right here I keep a couple of L'Oreal um, bronzers. I don't use these. I've never used these. Like they're still like in the package like never been open because I don't like shimmery bronzers they're pretty to look at and I would never throw them away I probably would give them away eventually um, before they get old but since they haven't been open they won't get old um I just keep them in here you know just to look at or, or whatever <laughs> like but they're they're pretty I just don't like shiny bronzers um right here is where i keep all of my loose powders so i have some um this goes right here i have some elf i have some nyc i have some um airspun i have um, i don't know what that is i have a uh, nyx and um who is this ruby kisses i've actually had like these three for like a few years and i probably used them once and didn't like them but i just didn't throw them away because i don't like throwing stuff away like that right here is where i keep um a few highlighters some of them are loose so i have some temp to i have some um tart i have benefit um i have Bosia. Um, I have some Wet n Wild stuff like that. Um, I have some NYX bronzers that's all broken up. A blush from Pretty Vulgar Cosmetics. I have some Too Faced, um, Too Faced bronzers, Chocolate Soleil. I have some Tarte. I have some Becca. These are some beautiful highlighters. They're so small and so tiny, and I love them. Oh, let me sit down some powders this is like a highlight I think uh, hold on let me open it this is the highlighter this is like a jelly highlighter and I think this one too yeah that one is too and these are like um I forget I forgot um like powder highlight they're pretty yeah, but I don't um, find myself using this palette because I'm so stuck on this palette here. Like my um, Juvia's Place highlighter palette. It looks like this and I use this palette on my clients all the time and it looks great on every skin tone. Every skin tone. And I also have my Ruby Kisses. Um, Contour palette, which I use on all of my clients, I love, 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 love. And I just have um, some powders from um, Maybelline Fit Me, and it's just in different shades. Gotta keep my Maybelline Fit Me powders. Okay, moving on. Right here is where I keep all of my lipsticks, like all of my lip pencils. Oh my god, I have so many freaking lip pencils. Um, NYX, um, mainly NYX. I have um also have a few um Nika K. I have some jumbo. Um I have some jumbo pencils from NYX. I have some from Mac Studio. I have a lot of pencils um from Amazon. These are the ones from Amazon. I don't know the brand, but I just needed some pencils and I just ordered them in bulk from Amazon. 
right here is where I keep all of my glosses so I have some also I have some Milani I have some um Mac I have um Kat Von D I have Anastasia Beverly Hills I have NYX I have Golden Wild actually these are liquid lipstick um these right here are lip glosses so Morphe um Rock um Murphy Anastasia Beverly Hills. Um right here is just a lip palette from Ulta. It's very cute if you like the berry shades and the reds and the dark mauvey pinks. Um I don't dip into this palette too much. Um but it's cool. Um I have another lip palette from L'Oreal and I have a couple of kale um lip glosses. Also down here is where I keep um a lot of my skincare. So I keep some e.l.f. um daily moisturizer. I keep some some replenishing um mist. I keep a lot of my glues. I keep my heart um ready set ready and setting spray I don't use. I keep um a max a Mac um fix plus down here is gone. Um, some setting sprays, some primer, and some gloss and lipstick, which I reach for the most. So this why it's in here by itself because I really only use like pinks and nudes and glossy lips on my clients. So for the last little thing is where I keep all of my palettes. All of my palettes. Um, I have Kat Von D cosmetics. I have NYX. I have Morphe. I have Make a Revolution, Morphe, Tarte, um, BH Cosmetics. Um, this is a BH Cosmetics Carly Babel palette. I have Mac down there. Morphe. Just a variety of palettes. And it goes all the way back i have makeup forever i have huda beauty um just a lot of different palettes like the anastasia beverly hills palette um i have this palette right here which i never use which i really need to um anastasia beverly hills lip palette which needs to be up top um, just a variety of palettes like Palettes. I don't use all of them, but I love all of them because they're my babies. Like most of them, I bought with my own money. Most of them, like ninety percent. And um, and I have some lashes which I use on my clients. Some bottom lashes. Some um. Oh, I have ColourPop too. ColourPop. Pure Cosmetics, Boxy Charm, um, a couple other palettes down there. Um, right here is where I keep some little rhinestones for the eyes if I want to do like a carnival look on one of my clients. Over here is where I keep Q-tips, um, just some little disposable wands and stuff for my clients. Like um, all types of disposable wands because I got to be sanitary doing makeup. Some pencil sharpeners, some hairpins, scissors, pencil sharpeners, lash, um, mascara, some, um, what's this called? Liquid liner, tweezers, just plenty of stuff that I need for my clients. And that's pretty much it for my little mini makeup collection, you guys. So again, this is just an overview of my beauty room. This is my baby, like, I spend most of my time in this room and I know it's not much to like big YouTubers, but it means a lot to me. So yeah, you guys, thank you so much for watching if you got to the end and I'm just so happy to be finally uploading it. I changed my beauty room around a lot, but um, I went over this in my head so many times of how I would do a beauty room tour because I used to watch beauty room tours like so much. So. I thank you guys for watching. More to come in the future. It's going to get bigger and better as time progresses. But I just thank you guys for rocking with me. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye, guys.